Hi. Let's take a look at how to invite someone into a subgroup. Now, I'm a manager of this group site, NRG, and I want to invite someone into one of the subgroups. Now, in this case, we've changed the name of the subgroups to be NRG groups. So the subgroups tab says NRG groups, and we have a NRG group directory instead of subgroups. Now, I first pick which group subgroup do I want to invite this person to. And I say, I want to invite this person to this subgroup called Columbia One. By clicking on that uh, subgroup name in the directory, I go to the home page, and I see that from the, the subgroup menu, I can invite members here, or from the drop-down, I can invite members here as well. When I click on the Invite Members link, it gives me two choices. To invite non-members, these are folks who are not in the group site already, or to invite group site members. These are folks who are already a member of this group site. I'm simply inviting them to become a member of this particular subgroup. In this case, I want to invite someone who is already a group site member. So by clicking on that link, I go to a presentation that shows me a list of all the members in the group. Now, I can scroll down and look. These are arranged alphabetically by last name. Or I can simply click in this field and begin typing this person's name. Now in this case, it's Jane, J-A-Y-N, and there she is. I see Jane Meckley. I can click Jane Meckley. If I want to invite someone else to the group at the same time, I simply hold down the Control key or the, uh, the Apple key, if I'm using a Mac, and I click the multiple names that I want to select to the group. In this case, I'm only inviting Jane, and so I'll unselect these. By selecting Jane, I hit Submit, and I have successfully invited Jane to my subgroup. The next time she logs in, she'll see a pop-up saying, you've been invited to this subgroup, do you want to accept? As soon as she accepts, she'll be the newest member of my new Columbia One subgroup. It's as easy as that.